What's going on everybody? My name is Moose and I'm alongside of Stickwork today and we're cooling like a pineapple smoothie on a Tuesday afternoon with this play. For MaddenSchool.com, this play is going to be coming out of the Carolina Panthers playbook. It's going to be out of the set list gun wide trips, tight end slot, and the play is going to be four verticals. A very simple play, but Stickwork's going to show you how to use this one very effectively. Yeah, so initially we'll start off against a Tampa 2 defense. Great thing about this play is it's going to work against any cover 2 style of defense. We're going to need to put the X receiver on a slant and then motion in that RB receiver in the slot, hike it while he's in motion, and you're going to see him split the defense. Did not get proper blocking right there, so we will do that again. But as you did see, him splitting the defense... And as you see right there, that is an easy throw. I mean, I'm there's pretty... No, there's no being the same zip code as that RB receiver. And the intricate piece of, to this play is that X receiver on the slant route. It's going to take away those defenders and leave that RB uh, receiver some space in the middle of the field. Now, this play's not going to be one that you're going to want to run every single down. Instead, it's going to be used when you need a big play late in the game to get big yards as well as key points. Yeah, and uh, I don't know about you, Moose, but I've been to a couple of Sunday school sessions in my day, and we're really splitting this defense kind of like the Red Sea. Out right there. you are, my friend. Right you are. Now, also with this, too, the wide receiver will get a little bit of a speed burst coming out of the backfield going to the right, as you can see right there. Now, that gives you options, <coughs> and with options it comes power. The more options you have, the more ability you have to uh, outsmart and outwit your opponent during the course of the game. The RB receiver once more wide open down the field for an easy touchdown and points. And something you touched on earlier, Moose, uh, like you said, this isn't a play you're going to want to run every down because simply enough, it won't work every down at that point unless your opponent is stubborn and wants to uh, just stay in a cover too because at that point, sure, run it every down. But however, for me, it's something I like to pull out once, maybe twice in a game because it can really change the complexion of a game. And uh, like, like Moose said, late in the game, possibly, you know, you need, you need a score or something of the sort of that. You go to that. They've been running, your opponent's been running a Tampa 2 or a cover 2 in general all game. And then you torch them up top for a big game. And now we're going to move into it against the cover three hard flat. Against the cover three sky, you'd want to just check down to the running back. But against a cover three hard flat, it's going to be a little bit different. Same setup, though. And you're going to be able to quick throw to that RB receiver, as you see right there. So once more, the cover three is going to give you, it's going to throw a hurdle in things, but we still have our options. We have the quick throw to the uh, RB receiver. We also, I believe we have the X receiver, and we also have the Y receiver. So more options as defensives change are going to allow you to just constantly expose players and just play effective Madden all night long. Yeah, and it's just pretty much a systematic type play. Um, you know, you're going to motion in this RB receiver against the cover three, and that's going to be your first read. If your opponent isn't using it, hit them real quick, 7 to 10 yards. If your opponent wants to use it or that, that's fine. Let them. We'll wait for that X receiver. And as you see, the space over there is unreal. And uh, we'll do it again for you. Show it one more time. He's going to get separation right there. We're going to hit him if we get some proper blocking. Now, we've seen this play work countless times. It's effective, and it's going to torch defenses all day long that your opponents may be thrown at you as far as the cover two and the cover three sky. Ladies and gentlemen, from everybody here at MaddenSchool.com, we want to thank you once again for watching us. Also, check out Stickwork on Twitter. He'll be posting about his draft champions grind, his road to the uh, group stages, and eventually onto the live stages and eventually onto a championship. So thank you once again for joining us here today. We'll be right back with more action.